Sakotsu's Mopan River is impassable, and when we got there, even the famous ferry to Sunantanich was being secured. We have three cables on this ferry. Um, we have released two already, but as the river continues rising, we are uh, very much aware of debris and so on coming downstream. So we are releasing the third cable, but that is not attached to the ferry. That, the ferry is actually secured um, on the banks. And as um, with our 24-hour monitoring, as the river rises, we attach, we uh, adjust our tensioners, and as it recedes, we, we release them to make sure the ferry stays afloat. Well, we're hearing about residents that live on the other side being stranded. What would be some of your advice for how they could get to this? Well, um, we saw some individuals trying to cross at this end. I would very much caution that if you're on the other side, head to higher ground and wait it out. Do not attempt to cross. Two individuals tried to cross a, a little bit earlier and were washed downstream. They're safe, but um, it's not advisable to try. Whether it's by uh, trying to swim across or by canoe or whatever, I would advise everybody to, if you're on the other side, stay put and head to higher ground until the water recedes. And there are serious safety concerns for guarding human life, even if the same hasn't been done for livestock. In the, in the areas up, up, more up we have um, farms and it was a scenery here of seeing chickens, pigs, even horses floating down. Um, but uh, it's because they're living up there in Guatemala, they live more like a farm. And so it is, people are, are doing, I mean, they are doing their farming and because of this weather, everything is going high, the river is going high and it's, it's washing away everything. Well, because of the, of the, of ETA going around, it is very dangerous. Um, the river do swell a lot. Um, it don't, well, hopefully it doesn't come out like uh, previous years ago. But it's not all bad news because down by the river in Benke, we found some flood time fishermen. Once the flood come in, you know, sometimes they got some farms will have some some fish pond and thing, and sometimes when you over flood, them fish come down. Then my friends, they take advantage of that, right? Once the river come out, they, they affect a lot of people, and they affect a lot of people who live side of the river, right? Hopefully the river go down and no bad casualties happen, right? But then got a lot of people with their families where we're really close to the river, like my buddy yonder, right? Mr. Wicho, he the stranded yonder, he can't come cross because the river too high. So he can't cross, because normally he would cross by the ferry or on his canoe, right? So, family is like then there, right? We try, he to watch we how we fish and thing, but you know, the things that you can't fight against weather, right? You can't fight against nature. Sherry's Halso, 7 News.